down, pause the center, drop the arms to 90 degrees, take it out into a plie, and drop down, and reach up nice and tall, lengthen through that spine and those limbs as you do, pose, our face towards the corner, your knees are not crossing your toes. in a curtsy plie. We're going to curtsy. <laughs> and we're going to pulse it down. So come on down into that deep curtsy and pulse.
should have woke those legs up. <laughs> All right, we're gonna come down onto your towel or mat or whatever you have. Come on down. It's also very humid here, so you might see my hair growing <laughs> throughout this video. It's kind of like a chia pet, the humidity. So, all right, on your back, pull and lift up through that pelvic floor. So think about that closing and the lifting. Transverse flat, hands behind the head. Come up into a curl. Now, if you take a look at your belly and it pooped, it got bigger, please make sure you're lowering your head down to where you can control that. Do not allow that abdominal wall to bulge. You're trying to get that compressed, okay? So I'm holding that in nice and tight. I want you to pick up both feet off of the floor. We're gonna do a single leg bicycle while the other one gets held in. If you prefer a leg on the floor while you do this, you certainly can, okay? That's your modification. So get your core set. Strong press out, one, two, bicycle that leg, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten, five more. Five, four, three, two. We're gonna reverse that. Press out, lift. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Five, four, three, two. One, pause, other leg, take it out of your bicycle, single leg, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, strong through the leg, press, thirteen, fourteen, reverse your direction, you already turned those quads on, so I really want you to feel them as you press, Pull, press, pull. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. And put your legs down. I think I'm gonna move this to the other side just so you can see. down flat, we're going to go into diamond. So your feet are going to come up, kick over your pelvis. Softness in the knees, so bend them a little bit. Because as you externally rotate those hips and press those heels together, the middle of your legs should look like a diamond shape, okay? Then you lock it. It is a double leg lower. So only go so low as you can keep that core compressed. You need to modify, bring your feet in very close to you and lower from there. Or just skip this one, okay? All right, here we go. Lowering down to where you can control and pull back up. You are really pressing those heels together. Exhale. Going at your own pace because everybody's gonna have a different level of lowering or amount of degrees they're working through the hips. It might be faster or slower than me, doesn't matter. It's all about the control. Whether you're inhaling down or exhaling down, whatever's comfortable for you and your breath. A couple more. One more. And lower down. We're gonna do two series of bridges, one with our feet very far out away from us to get some more hamstring, and then we're gonna bring our feet really close to us to emphasize a little bit more glute. You'll get glute in both, but if your feet are farther away um, in any bridge series, you're gonna get a little bit more of that hamstring kicking in. So instead of your feet underneath those knees, I want you to take a nice big step outward. If you wanna be up on your heels, that's fine. If this bothers your ankles to be this um, pointed, okay? Shoulders back. Get that core.
more steps and then press up into your bridge. Now it's gonna feel small because our legs are farther away from us. We don't have as much lift. So don't try to overextend through that back as you lift up. I'm still on this nice long line through the trunk. So lift up, come down about 80% of the way. Press back up, come down about 80% of the way and press back up. There's four, squeeze and press. that 
for for a second. We're going to do full teaser with a twist. I'm hoping I gave myself enough padding with my towel because that's not fun on cement. So single leg teaser with a twist. I think I said full, but we're doing a single leg teaser with, with a twist option. So your legs are going to come out, arms are going to come overhead. Okay. Get that belly compressed, get that pelvic floor in. As you roll up, one leg is going to come up. I want you to twist it open, close, and roll down. Other side. Twist, center, and roll down. Modification. Roll up, twist open, close, roll down. Okay? So, if you can't come all the way up for whatever reason, low back, disc issues, scalebone bothers, whatever, if you're on cement like me, it doesn't feel good. Then you can do a partial curl and come back down or any other rotation. You could go to crisscross, trunk twist, like whatever you want to do for some rotation on this one is fine. Okay, here we go. Roll it up, open, close. Breathing. Exhale, inhale, exhale. Strong leg go. Lock that quad. Lock that knee. Getting those obliques to twist and rotate. One more each leg. Actually, going to hold it. So stay up. This time you do get to grab. If you want to grab the inside of the leg, knee, maybe your knee is a little bent, I'm going to grab outside so I can get myself a little bit more rotated with this. I want you to go nice and tall, really open through that chest, twist through that spine. I'm looking back to get myself around a couple more degrees. Belly back, pelvic floor up. And release, push to the other side. Open. going to just shift your weight. Forward over your toes, press back through your heel. Okay? Make sure your butt's not too low. It really is in alignment with your back. Okay? Two 
from here, legs hip distance apart, maybe shoulder width. You're gonna bend your knees to 90 degrees, flex your feet, press your heels together. This is just gonna be, we're just gonna pulse this for endurance, okay? Kind of end range, hip extension. Forehead's gonna be down on top of your hand. Okay, so eventually don't be looking at me. <laughs> I suppose you could put your head to the side, but traditionally, neutral neck, okay? Forehead down. So press through those heels. Try to get your knees off the ground. Pulse at the top. One, two. Ooh. I gotta cab that up just a little bit. I said that wasn't that comfortable on that pubic bone. Yeah, not comfortable. Here we go. Press. One, two, three, four, five.
hasn't gone yet. <laughs> now let's stretch. I want you to bring the knees in, roll them off to the side, open up to that chest, and rotate that trunk. Open that rib cage. Other side.